What is going on guys? I'm here for a quick little video. I do not have enough time to start working on the fender flares and I'd really like to take my time on that. So I'm going to do something that's been requested a lot as well and I'm going to be taking the wheels off the Camborghini and I'm going to put them on the VET. Now, they're not the same bolt pattern. This does have 4 lug and 5 lug but it only has 5x100 or 5x114.3. I don't know which one it is but either way, won't fit the VET because the VET is 5x4.75 which is 5x120 point whatever. Anyways, I'm going to take the wheels off the Camborghini and I'm going to just mock it up on the car, probably with some camber, make it some, you know, look fitted. I don't know. Who knows? Maybe one day I'll make a stance vet, which hopefully will happen. Who knows? Um, but we'll get to it. Take the wheels off here, take the wheels off there, and we'll see how they look. So, just got both the wheels off. So, it's actually kind of annoying. If you don't know, Corvettes have these kind of uh, beauty cap things and you have to like take them each off individually and then there's a lug nut under there so obviously I don't want that showing that's pretty ugly but honestly I mean Chevy could have just put a nicer thing rather than having to build these and I don't know I think these are just ugly should get rid of these but so now I'm gonna have to basically take off fucking you know four wheels rather than I don't know just bigger pain in the ass As you guys can see here, uh, my front is a little bit wider than this one. This one is a 275, I believe, uh, 265, and then the Miata one is a 285. So, not too big of a difference, but this one's definitely maybe like half an inch taller overall. Now, <sighs> And then I'm just gonna set the car on these blocks and hopefully this doesn't touch. I don't know. Hmm. Maybe I can just put it under here. That looks so ridiculous. That looks so ridiculous, oh my god. If you guys could see this in real life, this is just insane. I'm gonna go get the other one on. This is so exciting, oh my god, this looks so funny. This looks so crazy. This is so insane. That's like how much camber I have on the Camborghini. That's like negative 20 degrees. 
but at least I got some fitment. <laughs> I'm gonna put the center caps on and take some pictures, see if we can get some trolls out in the internet. Oh my God, this looks so crazy. There's no way anyone's gonna believe this is real. Oh my God. So insane. Way too much camber in the rear. Now if I had smaller fronts and those in the rear, then it'd probably be okay, but this is just so much camber in the rear. Like that's just ridiculous. There's no way anyone would ever do this to a vet. Except for me, maybe, eventually. But who knows. We'll leave that for another time. So I hope to one day be able to do this, not to this vet. I would not do this to a Z06, um, but who knows, one day I might eventually do it to a base model or something like that. Um, just maybe get like a salvage title, something that hopefully people won't get too butthurt about. Everyone's gonna get butthurt. If it's a manual and it's got an LS1 and I stance it, people are gonna be butthurt. But that's kind of what I'm all about. So, might be doing that one day, who knows. I just cannot get over how ridiculous this looks. This would be so cool. So anyways guys, that's it for today. I hope you enjoyed this quick little video and I'll see you tomorrow for another video and peace out. Dare you, I double dare you motherfucker. Say what? One more time.